Have you tried everything to get rid of your back acne? But they are just not going away. In this video, I am gonna show you how to finally clear up those acne step by step. Hi my cutie pies, it's your girl Gitika and thank you so much for joining me. So as you guys saw in the title today, I am gonna talk about back acne, which is also called as back acne. So I have struggled with back acne that just won't go away. But after trying out few things, I finally got rid of them. So if you are someone who is tired of wasting your time on your back acne, then this video is for you. Also, before I start this video, can you please hit the like button and subscribe to my channel. That will help me a lot to create more content for you guys. So without any further ado, let's get started. I will talk about why does back acne happen, what you can do to control it and what you should not do, step by step guide to treat your acne and I will also recommend you some of my favorite affordable products that you can use to treat your acne and acne marks as well and I will also tell you few things that you can do to stop getting more acne. So let's start with why does it happen. Back acne can occur because of a lot of reasons. Number one, it can happen because of hormonal issues. Number two, it can happen because of your genetics. Yes, if someone in your family has back acne, then most likely you are, you are also going to have it. Number three, stress. Yes, stress can also contribute to your back acne. Then number four, sweat. Sweat can also cause back acne. Like if you wear tight clothes in summers or you wear tight clothes while working out in gym or while working in kitchen as well, it can happen. Or when you sweat and you don't take shower after too long, then it can happen also. Then number five, improper diet. Yes, improper diet can also be a reason for your back acne. Because unhealthy diet can affect our body in so many different ways. Like there are some foods that can rise your blood sugar level so quickly that can also cause a back acne. Now let me tell you what you can do to control your acne. So the most important thing that you can do is change your clothes regularly. Of course we all change our clothes regularly but especially if you are prone to acne then change your clothes twice in a day. And if needed then thrice in a day. And don't go to sleep with the same clothes on that you wore in the morning, okay? Then wash your clothes or towels with the mild detergents that are specially made for sensitive skin. Because those regular surf excellent type, those contain very high amount of fragrance and your skin might be allergic to fragrance. And fragrance can also trigger your acne, so don't use those. Okay, then you should keep your hair off your back because we apply hair oils, serums and leave-in conditioners on our hair and if it will touch your back then that can clog your pores and again that will cause back acne. Number four, wash your hair upside down because when we wash our hair we use shampoo and when we rinse it, the rinse will touch your back, right? And that can trigger your acne. So always wash your hair upside down and when you use conditioner then also apply your conditioner upside down or if you are not comfortable with upside down you can keep your hair in bun after applying conditioner or you can also use clutcher to keep it in place. You should always use clean and soft towels to clean your body. Don't use rough or harsh towels and don't use same towel again and again. And after using your towel, always wash it with mild detergent. And if you have any t-shirt that you no longer wear, you can also use it to clean your body. That will be really easy for you as well. You also need to dry your back properly because sometimes what happens is we, our hands don't reach on our back, right? So we wear our clothes over our wet body and that's when we make a mistake. Because on our wet body, bacteria can grow really easily and then you know, it can again lead to back acne. Also, wash your bed sheets and pillow covers regularly. 
because there are a lot of bacteria on our bed sheets and pillow covers as well. So basically what you need to do is change your bed sheet twice or thrice in a week and change your pillow covers every alternate day. To eat healthy you need to include a lot of vegetables, fruits and whole grains in your diet. So you can keep your acne at bay. Now let me tell you what you should not do at all. Number one, do not use harsh physical scrubs on your body. I know it can be tempting to use those on your white heads, black heads or acne but that can cause a lot of damage so please don't do it okay. Number two, do not wear tight clothes while working out because tight clothes can trap your sweat and rub it on your pores and that can cause a lot of acne so always wear loose clothes while working out. Number 3. Shower as soon as possible after your workout session. Do not let your sweat sit on your body for too long because bacteria can grow there and which can lead to back acne. Do not use loofah at all because just like scrubs, loofah can also exfoliate your body. So please don't use it, okay? Don't use regular bar soaps on your body unless it's specially made for your acne. Then do not pick on your acne because just like your face, if you will pick your acne, it, it will leave scars and cause inflammation. So do not pick on your acne and then don't do any DIYs on your body. Now let me give you step by step guide to treat your back acne or acne scars as well. Step 1. You need to use a body wash which has benzoyl peroxide in it. Because benzoyl peroxide is antibacterial, so it will kill all the bacteria. And get something which has 5 to 5.3 percent of benzoyl peroxide in it. Basically, what you need to do is apply it on your body and then leave it on for 2 to 5 minutes. Then it will work on your acne, it will kill all the bacteria, penetrate into your body, and kill all the bacteria. So, and then wash it off. If you don't want to use something which has benzoyl peroxide, then you can get body wash which has salicylic acid or tea tree in it. Salicylic acid helps in drying down your acne so, and it will also help in acne scars as well. And tea tree is also really good for acne prone skin. And few recommendations that I have are first one is benzoic gel wash. Uh, it has 5% of benzoyl peroxide so it is perfect and you can easily get it from any nearby chemist and it I think costs around 130 or 135 rupees. Second recommendation that I have is Kaya Acne Free Purifying Cleanser. Uh, yes, it's a face cleanser but it totally works on your body as well. It has salicylic acid in it so it's perfect for body acne. I have tried it on my back and my back body is very sensitive and it worked on my acne without irritating my skin. So you can definitely try it out and it costed me about 150 rupees. Or you can try out Dermaco 3% AHA DHA foaming face wash. It also worked really well for me. Uh, it has salicylic acid, glycolic acid and mandelic acid in it and all of these ingredients are proven to be working really well for acne prone skin. So definitely try it out and if you want to try out something which has tea tree in it then you can try out the, uh, the body shop tea tree body wash that works really well as well. If you have very dry and sensitive body and nothing seems to work on that then definitely try out the Aveeno Moisturizing Body Wash. It is perfect for you. Then step 2 is use very soft and clean towel to dry your body and do not skip to clean your back body as well. Step 3. Use a moisturizer which has gel-like consistency. You can use something which has salicylic acid, niacinamide or hyaluronic acid in it. Niacinamide helps in uh, acne scars and it also helps with brightening up your skin. So you can use a body moisturizer which has these kind of ingredients. You can try out the Requil Acne Clarifying Gel on the certain areas of your body 
where you are getting acne. It, it works really well on active acne. Or if you have acne scars, then you can use the Requel Pit Stroke Gel. That works really well on acne scars. If you want something in a spray form, then definitely try out the Quick Derma Cells Up Body Spray. Uh, it is specially made for body acne. It is non-irritating. It will unclog your pores and it works really well on active acne. So you can definitely try it out. You just need to spray it on the areas where you are getting acne and it will work really well. You can also use body lotions which has ceramides in it. Ceramides are great to heal your skin. Uh, you can try out the Requel Hyaluronic Acid and Ceramide Moisturizer that will work really well. Or you should try out the Dermafic Body Serum that also works really well. And lastly, I just want to say that if your acne is getting worse and nothing seems to work on that, then definitely consult your dermatologist. They will tell you what is causing you back acne. I hope this video helped you guys and if it did then don't forget to hit the like button and also please take few seconds to leave your lovely comments in the comment section. I would love to read your comments. And I will see you guys in my next one. Till then stay positive, spread positivity and take care of yourself. Bye.